Yeah, in my dear children. As a continuation of dielectric and polarization, now we are going to deal with dielectrics. So we know what are dielectric. Dielectrics are electrically non-conductive materials. Okay, dielectrics are mainly classified into two: non-polar molecules and polar molecules. Non-polar molecules means a molecule in which the center of mass of positive charges coincide with the center of mass of the negative charges. Okay, positive and negative charges are coinciding. Such molecules are called non-polar molecules, and they have symmetrical shape. Since the positive and negative charges are coinciding, they have zero dipole moment. Okay, because positive and negative charges are not separated, they are coinciding, and hence net dipole moment is zero. And examples are hydrogen, oxygen, nitrogen, etc. Okay. Now next one is polar molecules. Polar molecules means the center of mass of positive charges does not coincide with the center of mass of negative charges. That means positive and negative charges are slightly separated. Such molecules are called polar molecules. They have the unsymmetrical shape, and since positive and negative charges are separated, such molecules have permanent dipole moment. Okay. Now we can see what happens when non-polar molecule is placed in external electric field and also in the absence of external electric field. Non-polar molecule when it is placed in uh, in the absence of external electric field, if there is no external electric field, we know that positive and negative charges are coinciding; they are not separated. Okay, so each molecule does not have any dipole moment. So here, dipole moment of each molecule is. Zero, and since each molecule does not has dipole moment, net dipole moment is also zero. So, in as a uh, as a conclusion, we can say that net dipole moment of each molecule is zero, and uh, then total dipole moment of all the molecule is also zero. Okay, now what happens when it is placed in an external electric field? Presence of external electric field that means E zero is not equal to zero. So, in the presence of external electric field, that means E zero not equal to zero. Let the direction of external electric field is towards right. Okay. So, in the presence of external electric field, here the positive and negative charges slightly stretches out. Okay. Here positive and negative charges are slightly separated, and all the negative charges faces one region because here this is positive charge plate here, and here there is negative charge plate. Because of that, the direction of electric field is from left to, to right. Okay, so because of that, all the negative charges faces the positive charge plate, and all the positive charges faces the negative charge region. Okay, so in uh, as a result, each molecule develops a dipole moment because negative and positive charges are slightly separated. Okay, so each molecule has a dipole moment, and hence there is a total dipole moment. And they produces an induced dipole moment in the direction of the electric field. Okay, dipole moment direction is from negative to positive. So each each molecule has a dipole moment, and there produces a net dipole moment from negative to positive. That means in the direction of the external electric field. Clear? Now, what happens? Polar molecule is placed in an external electric field. We know polar molecule means positive and negative charges are already they are separated. So each molecule has a dipole moment. Here, these are all polar molecule, and each molecule has dipole moment. But these dipoles are aligned in different different direction, random direction, no? Okay, and hence the net dipole moment is consumed to be zero. So each molecule has dipole moment, but since they are arranged in random direction, net dipole moment is zero. But when an external electric field is applied, E zero not equal to zero means in the presence of external electric field. As before, direction of external electric field let it is from negative to positive. That, sorry, from left to right, from positive to negative. Towards right is the direction of the external electric field. So what happens? These negative charges and positive charges they reorient. Okay, already they are separated. They reorient in such a way that negative charges faces the positive charge plate, and the positive charges faces the negative charge plate. Right. And hence, each molecule has a dipole. Already, they have dipole moment, and here, net dipole moment is not equal to 
zero because all the negative charges are facing one region and positive charges are facing another region and they produce a net dipole moment also in the direction of the external electric field okay so we can say that when a polar molecule and a non polar molecule when they are placed in the external electric field net dipole moment will be their net dipole moment is not equal to zero or there produces a net induced dipole moment or in short we can say when a dielectric is placed in an external electric field the dielectric is said to be polarized that means positive and negative charges will be separated and they produces a net dipole moment and hence a dielectric either polar molecule or non polar molecule when it is placed in external electric field it gets polarized okay children